Hey y'all, what's going on? It is Saturday and this is what we're going to be eating today. We're going to barbecue some chicken thighs on the grill. Say what's up, baby. Hey y'all. She don't think y'all need lights, but I'm blind. Y'all might be like me, need lights. So, let me tell y'all what I put in these chicken thighs. I use a little bit of Creole seasoning. It wasn't a little bit, it was quite a bit, see? Season your chicken, your meat good, okay? Black pepper, salt. I use some of these Grill Mates barbecue seasoning and onion powder. So yeah, that's what I did. I put all that in there. Let me show y'all my husband's beans. He think I didn't, I don't know the secret to his beans. But he don't. I'm gonna figure it out. <laughs> But they look good though. Onion, tomatoes. Let's see what else we got in here. Some other type of seasonings. I don't know, but we're gonna figure it out. They smell good too. <laughs> so we got this chicken here, and I'm just gonna season that real good. You know, make sure the pieces are covered we're real, real good. And then we're gonna put these on the grill. And I'll be back. All right, so just mix your chicken up. Make sure you get the seasoning on everything. On all that chicken. Cover it up good. It's that hubby popping a soda over there. Yeah, before our kids get them off. They got juice in there. They don't need all that soda. Hey, come here, right quick. What you gonna do? Go to the grill. Put some seasoning on this. While I'm holding the camera and with my gloves. Put uh, yeah, some more Creole. No, just put it on there. What are you doing? I don't know what he was doing. I didn't want to get your phone. That's all. Just no, just get it on there, babe. This needs to be broken up. Give me a spoon. Just a little bit. It don't need that much. Go ahead and add some pepper. A little bit of pepper on there. Okay. A little bit more salt. Hey, if you know the cooking, a little boy, bit more. be careful with salt. My first thought, when I first started cooking, I didn't realize okay. salt come out so fast and so overpowered. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and add some cooking. more. Because everybody watching this don't cook. Onion powder. Word. And some more of that barbecue seasoning. We'll just, I just want to flip all that around and... Hi y'all. That's my daughter who just celebrated a birthday yesterday. Give me a little bit more on that, that piece right there. You should let us do this trial run on the new phone, okay. the birthday phone, girl. You shouldn't say. <laughs> Here, wait, 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 you're not through. Here, what's the name? Yeah, I gotta stop these charcoals. Get that um, barbecue seasoning right there and put some on this piece right, right here. here. Yeah. All of it? Yeah, just pour it all in there because it's not a whole lot anyway. Okay. Just get that on there real good. Make yeah. sure your chicken is washed really good, too. Can I, else? Uh, I think that's good enough, babe. See all that seasoning on there? You gotta try to rub all that around on some other pieces here. Because you don't want to put too much seasoning. You can add a little bit more onion powder. That's fine. Go ahead. Just sprinkle it all over in there. Okay. That's good. Okay. All right. So we're going to get all this mixed up and then... We'll place these on our grill. Hit that pause button. All right, tell them what you're doing, baby. I am about to put these chicken parts over some hot coal. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm a <laughs> cooking caveman style. <laughs> now, I'm throwing it on my little Weber, y'all. I put my coals on one side, so you don't have to put your meat on top of the heat. Some people, don't real, realize that's not a good thing to do. But I do like the heat to come up through. Some people put foil on the grill, I don't. On certain meats, I don't. Unless I'm messing with some ribs. Or uh, what else would I use the foil on? Ribs. Uh, oh, yeah, when she's doing onions and stuff on the grill. Oh, yeah, that'd be good. Onion blossoms or whatever you call them. I don't like them. Oh, body slam. Don't hurt them, baby. They already did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the true 
my crazy husband. Well, when y'all see this out the ground, it's going to want a piece. I want all that seasoning to stay on that. Okay. Still a bunch of seasoning in that bowl, too. Yeah, but I don't know. So these chicken thighs are on this grill. All right, I need to get it covered. We'll be back. All right, y'all, my fries are a little, a little on the hot side. They smell good. So I'm having to move my meat around a little bit. The charcoal is jumping. It's only been a couple of minutes, but. Should've did that snake move. Well, it'll be all right in a minute. She, my wife talking about the snake method with the charcoals. If anybody ha hadn't heard of it, you, you should look it up. You make a trail around your grill on the inside like a circle. And you break a part of it out and light it and let it burn around the circle. They call it the snake method. And it uh, keeps, the, keeps the fire longer at a steady heat easier. But uh, I was a little lazy on that too. Mm -hmm. Normally you do that when you're cooking a whole lot of meat. But we're only doing this one pack, so I wasn't worried. I wasn't tripping on that. <laughs> All right, y'all. Okay. Well, we'll be back. All right, so these chicken thighs are being flipped. And they're looking real nice. They look good, man. Mm -hmm. I smell good. Put them a little closer to it. Anytime. Winter time, summertime, springtime, fall time. Anytime. Hmm. Anytime. <laughs> Keep the house cool for sure. Okay. In the summer. I say keep the house cool for sure. I know, and I said in the summer. <laughs> oh, I thought you said something else. Uh-uh. All right. We'll be back. We'll be back. Yeah. They look like they are almost ready, huh? Yep. You want to put any sauce on them? Um, yeah, we can, I guess, huh? Yeah, that one ain't got much on Yeah, let's have for Junior's. Yeah, because he don't eat it. He don't like you know that. what? We don't have to. We just put it on the side, can't we? Yeah. Well, bring me a little for mine. Do we still have any? Maybe so? Okay, I'll go get it. All right, y'all, here we go. Getting this meet up off of here. Gonna go on here and eat some of these mean beans. That's all I'm gonna call my beans, mean beans. We didn't really know we was gonna grill, so we didn't get to set it up like we really wanted to. Just kind of like, hey, the daughter wants some barbecue. We want a little barbecue for the birthday. But y'all still get to see how we eat. It's coming off. Get out of here, Flair. <laughs> we outside. That heat. Yeah. Push them on. And we are now done. Mm -hmm. All that crisp right there, that's 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 flavor. My favorite part. All right now. Alright, so along with the beans that my hubby is cooking and they do look and smell amazing. I did some fresh ears of corn. And all I did with the corn is put salt, some pepper. A whole stick of butter and a little bit of sugar in it like maybe a tablespoon of sugar so it can make it kind of sweet and that's it on that all right y'all so the food is ready we also put some links on the grill too so it's just a quick I guess it's kind of quick Saturday meal it's really not that quick but hey it's a good Saturday meal 
for our birthday girl. And until next time, I want to thank you guys. Please subscribe, like, and share. And I'm almost at 100 subscribers. Thank you again.